In this Roblox Studio tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the new Video Frames feature, which was just added to Roblox a couple of weeks ago. These are videos playing in front of me here, on a Surface GUI. There is a limit on how many videos you can play at once. That limit is currently two videos playing at once. However, you can see I have three screens here, and I have written a script that will play one video first, and then play the other two videos. I'll show you that script and how to add a video to your game in a second. This would be a good time for you to hit that subscribe button and like the video as that really helps me continue to make epic content. This new feature allows you to play videos in your games. This is very exciting as it opens up a world of possibilities for developers that will no doubt spawn new game ideas that weren't possible before. So getting back to the script. As I said the limit is two videos playing simultaneously. So, what I am about to show you, is one way to handle this. You could of course have multiple video frames in your game, but just make sure in your script, that you're only playing two at a time. Okay, here is the script I wrote, to play and stop other videos from playing. I noted that it needs to be a server script and not a local script. In this case I have just placed the script in the same folder where the surface GUIs are but you could write the same script from server script service if you wish. It's just a while loop that plays or stops the videos. Ideally, you would want to check for some event that triggers the video to play. And perhaps have a function that turns all other videos off. Okay, let me show you quickly how to add a video frame. First, I'll just comment this script so that I can play the new video I create. Add a new part and resize or scale it to the size you would like. Move it into position, and call it something like video part. Open up your toolbox. Choose videos from the drop-down and select a video as shown. At the moment you can only use these videos. Roblox is adding the ability to add your own videos very soon. Please subscribe to my channel so that I can notify you when that is available. You can see I clicked the video from the toolbox, and it has added it, to my part called video part. We actually need a Surface GUI for it to work. Add a Surface GUI as shown, and make sure your video is a child of the Surface GUI. On the Surface GUI, check to make sure you have the face on the correct side. If it's not on the correct side, look in the properties and change the face like this. Now select the video frame, and change playing and loop to on, by checking the box as shown. That's all there is to it. Let's run that to check and it should be playing. There you go, that's how you can add video frames to your Roblox game. And also how to manage the two videos running at a time limit. This is the God of Coding at Epic Blocks Dev signing off, see you in the next one.